Hey kids, it has been so much fun over the last several weeks talking weather. I mean, we've covered some fun topics. We've made snow in my kitchen. We've talked about tornadoes. We've talked about hurricanes. And I even showed you a little bit of green screen magic. So I know we are finishing up the school year. So I thought, let's put this all together. Let's talk about all the topics in one and just show you a little bit behind the scenes of what I do every single day here at News 4. I'm meteorologist Laura Bannon, so let's start right there. Hold the brakes. How did I get that title? Well, I went to school. I went to Mississippi State University, which is a four-year program. I have my bachelor's in science and atmospheric sciences. And there's a lot of great colleges all over the country. And so you can talk with mom and dad about what you wanna do in the future. And if you wanna become a meteorologist and you have any questions, feel free to reach out to any of us here at News 4. We'd be happy to answer your questions. So it's a four-year program. I'm a meteorologist and I forecast the weather. So. What is the weather? Well, the weather is what's happening right now. And we know the weather can be crazy here in Middle Tennessee. It could be nice and sunny. It could be mean with thunderstorms out there and it also can be pretty cold and snowy. Snow is always fun here in Middle Tennessee, right? So every day when I come into work, I've got to look at all those elements and put together a forecast. So it's actually a pretty complicated process, but Here's what you need to know, and this is something we've talked about over the last several weeks, and we talk about the atmosphere. Think of the atmosphere that it has several layers, almost like a cape, right? So it goes up, 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 way above our heads. So how do we get that information? Well, we've got a lot of data. One thing that we like to use, are these really smart balloons. These balloons go up in the sky, and it gives us that information. So it comes back down here, and then it goes into all these cool websites. So everything is done on a computer now. So let me show you, come geek out with me over here. Now, first things first, one thing about my weather center is, well, look, I don't have a window. Rude, right? Well, here we go. Here's my window right here. We've got a lot of cameras out there. So for us, when we're putting together the forecast, I want to be able to look outside and know what's happening. So that's why we've got so many cameras all over the place that we can monitor what's happening. Does this look familiar? This is a radar. So this is how we are tracking the rain. We can also switch views to see the clouds that are out there. So this is just a radar rainy view that we're seeing. Here's my window. But when it comes to forecasting, I get in pretty early and I'm going to admit when I first started, it took me kind of a couple of hours, but I start off with a blank sheet every single morning. And this eventually turns into this. So how did I get there? Well, this is where we get a little bit nerdy and we start having some fun. Remember when we talked about cold fronts, warm fronts, areas of low pressure, high pressure. So here it is. This is everything put together. So I'm looking here at Middle Tennessee. Here we are right here. So I'm looking at all this information and this is all graphs. Some of it is just pretty pictures. I used to actually color in some of this information. And then we've got all these colors and numbers. Oh boy, there's so many numbers that we look at. But over the next several days, I will use this information. Whoa, what's that? A lot of big scary colors, but this is some of those layers of the cake that I'm looking at every single morning to put together a forecast. So I'm looking at also from the Storm Prediction Center about the mean scary weather. Of course, we don't want that. So once I put all this information together, this is how I get my seven day forecast. So how does this get to here? Well, we now have websites that we use and I'll sit here and I'll punch all the information and it will directly go to the computer. I call this my weather PowerPoint because it's a bunch of different slides and it has a lot of fun information. Another question that I get a lot of the time is, well, are you reading a teleprompter? Uh-uh. This is where it gets fun, right? So come on over here. Remember we talked about the green screen? Well, here it is. Yes, I'm standing out in front of a green screen and I can see on the side and in front of me. So my forecast, that sheet of paper, that's actually my script. 
I hope you learned something fun here over the last several weeks. I hope you guys have a wonderful summer.